sound as a longitudinal wave motion. Sound is produced when any object is set into vibration, a vibrating tuning force, musical instrument, ringing bell, etc. are sources producing different kinds of sound. All these vibrating bodies produce compression in the surrounding medium on a forward motion and rarefaction on a backward motion. These compression and rarefaction traveling in a given direction form a longitudinal wave motion in that direction. Thus, sound waves are longitudinal waves which can travel through gas, liquid or solid medium. The propagation of sound waves in air can be easily understood by considering the vibrations of tuning force. When the tuning fork is at rest, the air near the tuning fork is in the form of equidistant layer. When the tuning fork is set into vibration, its prongs bend outwards and inwards alternately. When the prongs of tuning fork bend outwards, the layers near the prongs are pushed away they are crowded together and compression C is formed. As the prongs of tuning fork bend inwards, the nearby air layers are separated and rarefaction R is formed. By this time, on account of elasticity of air, the compression C has moved some distance ahead. Again, when the prongs of tuning fork bend outwards, a new compression C is formed. During this time, rare fraction R follows the first compression C. As the prongs of tuning fork vibrate continuously, compressions and rare fractions are produced alternately. They travel through air in rapid succession in the form of longitudinal waves. In this way, sound travels in the form of longitudinal waves.